go for it. Okay, my name is uh, Devin Shepard from North Chicago. And uh, what I found most inspiring or learned from this class was probably, and in fact, I was actually just discussing this with my dad during Thanksgiving, is uh, how much really doesn't get in the media reported as far as the good things that go on all over the world. Um, how majority of times, just the negative things. And uh, this makes you think that, you know, maybe if there's just a little bit more push to put some of these stories we've learned about, you know, they're so inspiring that maybe it would just, you know, just inspire others and just kind of make it like grow. So I think that was definitely what, what I've learned the most in this course. Um, and about myself, um, I don't know, I gotta think about that. I guess like, uh, I guess probably what I've learned about myself with this course is, is how you start to almost implicate the things you learn in this class in your life in this course, I guess. Um, so, and it just helps you kind of maybe organize your life a little bit better and be able to handle situations a lot better because that way you have like a method to go about doing things. So uh, I think that's definitely something I've learned about myself is just how using the things we learn in this class can not only be used in certain situations around the world, but also just throughout your life. And just like small things like that can even be a kind of peace builder in a way. So that that's interesting. So so in terms of um, seeing natural ways in, in terms of studying what peace builders are doing in communities here and abroad, you started it sounds like to think about ways to use that in your own life. Were there specific aspects of any of the stories or or kind of specific pieces that um, that influenced the way you thought and started to influence how you how you are? Yeah, I think, uh, I mean, one of the main things that always kind of comes up is this whole idea of, like, dialogue. And uh, I think if you ever, like, I'd say there's a couple of situations throughout the semester in my class where, you know, you start to think, oh, man, how am I going to handle with, deal with this? You know, like, instead of just kind of, as we say, building up a conflict narrative about a person and just thinking, man, how, how am I going to deal with this? You know, like, I'm just going to, instead of thinking, oh, I'm just going to ignore this, this person, it's not even worth dealing with, you think to yourself, you know, like, well, just creating this, that dialogue to begin with is just such a big building step. Mm. It's what we learn from the stories. And, uh, and it's true. I mean, because it, it doesn't even have to be like the, like a talk where you sit down for like a half an hour and just talk it out with them. It could be the simplest thing, just like, just like a little like statement, like about the weather, or just like, how you doing? And then and I think it's just surprising that, uh, I mean, I was surprised and in, in, in certain situation, within a week this person came back to me and came to me and he was just talking to me. So I think it's just uh, interesting this, uh, this whole idea of this making that push to, uh, you know, that uh, effort to do something and just initiating that dialogue can just be such a big step. Mm -hmm. so. Great. Um, hel helpful to hear that. So um, do you think since, you know, National Peace Academy is really, this is um, our first classes here at Case. Um, what do you think about peace education as far as do you think it's important and, and if so, um, why? Uh, I think it's, yeah, I think it's very important. Um, and I think it kind of goes along with what I was talking about. Uh, I think if people are just given, because a lot of times you don't really just get a chance to think about peace building in your life. You know, you're just, you're doing all this stuff. And so conflicts are definitely going to, because they happen to everybody, they're going to come throughout your life. And given a chance to think about peace building, peace education, will this prepare you better for these conflicts that happen in your life? Mm -hmm. So I think that's a very important thing for especially college students. I mean, you're getting thrown into a, a, a world with people from all over the place, different call everything. So uh, I mean, there's always going to be some kind of conflict, and having kind of it's almost like a preparation, and it's uh, the the better way to deal with it for sure. Thank you. I appreciate you making the time. Yeah, thanks for having me. Thanks, Devin. <laughs>